Visitor auto messages are a great way to engage with anyone who comes to your site and either doesn't have an account or doesn't sign in. Today, I'm gonna to walk you through setting up a visitor auto message for your pricing page. It will encourage your visitors to open a conversation with your sales team, which in turn will help you drive more conversions. First, let's see an example on our demo website. You can see if we navigate to the pricing page, a message appears which asks if I need any help. I'm gonna show you how to create and configure this exact message. So let's switch over to Intercom to get started. Visitor auto messages are part of the Engage product and to create one, we simply click on this blue button in the top right. Next, we wanna give our message a title. We're gonna call this one Pricing Conversation. It's always important to remember using descriptive names from the start will help when you have a lot more messages in the future. Now we're gonna pick the audience and rules to ensure the message is only sent to people on the pricing page. So we're gonna select the rule to target the current page URL and we're gonna set it to is www.demomap.io forward slash pricing. We'll also set it to appear if the visitor has visited the page more than three times. This way we know they're definitely interested. Next, we're gonna write our message and set who the responses go to. With Intercom, you can send messages from say your CEO, but assign the responses to the sales team. This way, visitors might feel like they're speaking to someone important, which will encourage them to open a conversation. In this case, I'll just assign the responses to myself. Next, we want to enter our text and decide which format we'll send it in. We're going to give it a very personal, simple feel, so it just looks like a message they see from their friends. We always suggest that the visitor auto message are very short and to the point, so keep that in mind when writing your own. Once we've added the content, we need to decide how it'll be delivered. On the left, you can see we have three options, badge, snippet, and show full message. The badge lets you send it as a very unintrusive notification. A snippet gives the user a shortened version which they must click to see the message. And the show full message shows the full thing. In this example, we're gonna show the full message. And that's it. All we need to do is set the message live. Give it a go in your test environment and see how you get on. 